Hi, it's Lindsay from the Lindsay Smith Group. Thanks for tuning in to another episode of my Tuesday morning market update. It's my opportunity every week to share with Oshawa, Whitby and Clarington kind of what's happening with real estate. So I'm just fresh back off the boat. I just actually came back after some spending some time in Italy. I gotta say, to get the opportunity to go to Europe, Italy is probably one of my top choices. San Marino, um, I could talk about what we saw, but the reality was the pasta there is like you've never tasted before. Let's just jump straight into the numbers. Um, in the last week, we've had 278 homes come to market, so newly listed for sale. We've had 88 homes sell conditionally, and we've had 84 homes leave the market sold firm, meaning they've got sold signs on them. So 172 properties have come off the market, 278 properties newly listed for sale. Now, when I look back this week, I did a year over year, and it's really interesting because a lot of times people are complaining about it being slow this year, or how it's changed from last year, but really, the number of listings for Oshawa, Whitby, and Clarington are down by 52 homes for sale. Now, as you may know through these videos, I'm kind of statistical in approach. I like to know what's going on with the market. I hear a lot of agents, I hear a lot of sellers and buyers complaining about the market the way it is right now. You know what's really interesting? Last year was a really good year for the start of the year and it kind of dropped off. But right now we have 52 fewer homes for sale at the end of August than we did of August last year and we sold 33 more homes in August of uh, this year than we did last year. So we're in a pretty healthy market. I had something really interesting happen this morning and this kind of gives you a bit of a, a sense of what's going on with the market out there. I looked at a house this morning and they had three agents in. I was one of three. 850 to 900,000 was one agent. Another agent said in around the 700 to 750,000 range. And clearly the comparable sales showed that the house was worth in the mid 600 range. So there was more than $200,000 in difference between the top price and really the price that's gonna get the property sold. If you are planning on getting your house sold, even if you've got a family member or a friend in real estate, and you're looking at getting your house sold, if you've booked an appointment, I would love to be the second opinion. In many cases, the second opinion does one of two things. It will either put more money in your pocket or it'll actually get a sold sign on your property. If you've got any questions about the market, um, please feel free to give us a call at uh, 905-743-5555 or you can just catch me at the email at the bottom of the screen. Have a great week. Oshawa, Whitby and Clarington.